it's not a walkthrough, playthrough, review, anything like that. It's just me playing the game badly, so you can see what it looks like. This is Joust on the Atari 2600. Ah, yes. Two player. We have Joe on player two. And I don't know how we start. This is how we start. Okay. Um, okay, fire button makes you jump. And the idea okay. there's, there's going to be some eggs or something. Or you've got to jump on the other person's head, kind of thing. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's what you do. You fly your emu and you I'm smack them on the head. The purple one. Yeah. Right. <laughs> and you smack people on the head. And there's something about eggs somewhere on the arcade game. I don't know if we're going to get them on here. Um, oh, right. I've got flying. Mine doesn't. Oh, okay. Mine didn't want to fly for a moment. But yeah, you, you, Oops. you smack people on the head. Get up there. Yeah. This is really hard. It ain't easy. Oh, oh crap, what's going on? What the hell is that? A pterodactyl? <laughs> it looks like a squid. <laughs> oh, what's going on? I've died. I'm dead. I've gone for lives left. You're on your own. No! <laughs> We've not been seeing each other that long. <laughs> Can't die. Okay, well, I'm just going to have to go and... Kill yourself when I'm dead. Yeah. yeah. I can't get up. <laughs> Yeah, I never played this or even saw this in the arcade. Oh my oh, right. god! Yeah, what is that? Oh, well, it looks like a oh <laughs> something that killed me. Yep. I guess it's a thing that comes along if you're kind of arsing around a bit too much and and there to speed you up. But I can't get up there. Okay, handle, handle the button. Like, like. Uh. Okay. <laughs> you went into no bombs <laughs> Oh, yay. Okay, I think I won. Yeah, you definitely won. You've got 9,800. Never 200. Oh! You still got three lives. I hope one out. Two lives. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh, go up, go up, go up, go up. No, oh. Yeah. I never played it in the arcades. I did play like arcade conversions of it or emulation or whatever on the first time I played it was on PS2. Can't say I was ever a fan of the game, but I never played it two player before. It was always just me versus the computer. I think the arcade had, oh, egg. I knew there was something to do with eggs. Yay. Um, now what? Okay. Ooh, there's a lighter cord. Oh, oh. Kills you. <laughs> yeah, they do. Oh, I oh, dropped an egg. <laughs> I laid an egg. Yes, gimme, give gimme, give gimme, <laughs> oh, I died. And that is Joust on the Atari 2600. Oh, we can have another go. Okay. I've got to redeem myself somewhere else. Uh, Maybe egg. not. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll go for the other guys and leave, as long as I can tell which one is you. you. <laughs> yeah. 
seems a little... Oh, that's got to get. Oh. 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 And I was trying not to get you. <laughs> Alright, which one's you? Oh. That one. <laughs> <laughs> Just going for a walk now. Oh. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> no. <laughs> Run away. Oh. Oh. oh that I think me. I can't get that. <laughs> okay. Right, I'll I'll call it a day there. That is joust <laughs> on the Atari twenty six hundred. It is that Given the limitations of the system, it's a pretty good version of it. Um, yeah. Okay, thank you for watching. Hello. Today's question for Q&A is from Cats Games Whatever. Link to their channel down there. Um, here's a question for Q&A. Why have you not purchased Redout yet if you're a Wipeout fan? I know you're going to say Wipeout does it better, so why bother? But Redout is so excellent, it pains me you will never get to play it. I find this question presumptuous. <laughs> um, taste in games is very, very personal. The fact that you think it's absolutely brilliant does not mean I should think it's absolutely brilliant and your 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 question seems to suggest that I should um, no so firstly I haven't bought it and you say yet you presume that I'm going to no I'm not um, I'm sorry I don't mean to sound confrontational but I found the question kind of it irked me it is presumptuous so my response is it's a little confrontational. It's not really what I mean to be doing. It's just... Um, I'd never heard of the game. So I have never bought it. Primarily because I'd never heard of it before. Um, so when I read your question I thought, well, I don't know what that is. So I'll go and have a look. And I looked at a video. And it is impressive. Um, graphically gorgeous. But... So is Wipeout. I mean, uh, the, the Wipeout on PS4 and whatever, and on PS3, glorious. Um, so, as you say, Wipeout does it... I don't know if Wipeout does it better or not, because I haven't played Redout, but Wipeout does it brilliantly. And I haven't completed Wipeout, so, quite simply, why would I? Um, I, I don't need another Wipeout game. If I want to play a game like Wipeout, I'm going to play Wipeout, especially since I haven't finished it. That I have no need for another game like it. Um, and that's really all there is to it. And all, I'm, I'm kind of like, I'm not interested in games that copy other games so blatantly. I mean, you can have games that are influenced by other games. It's like why would you listen to Fields of the Nephilim when you can listen to the Sisters of Mercy? And that, that comes into the same thing, except that Fields of the Nephilim are really funny. And you see, they are offering something kind of different. You can see where they're coming from. You can see they have taken the style and the sound of early-ish Sisters of Mercy and done it a bit different. But you need something to set it apart, and I, I just I don't see anything different enough in Redout to make me want to play it as well as Wipeout. Um, there's just no reason to. Uh, if it pains you that I will never play it, why? Why? Why does it pain you that I will never play it? Why should it? Why should it matter to you that I'm not going to play the game that you like? In, you like it. You play it. Enjoy it. Feel good that you're playing a great game. It doesn't matter if I'm not going to play it. Um, I don't understand. <laughs> I just don't. Um, yeah. Kind of, I am, I'm kind of befuddled by this one. Um,
that really is all there is to it. It's like, I'd never heard of it, now I've heard of it. It's just Wipeout. And I've got Wipeout, so why would I? That, that I can't give a better answer than that. That's just all there is to it. Um, sorry if that's not the answer you wanted to hear, but... <laughs> that's, it's that basic, really. Okay. Um, anyone else who's got a question you'd like answering in a video like this, leave your question in the comments below. Begin it with for Q&A, so I don't just answer it in the comments. And thank you for watching. Um, it says here Bedway offers his thanks to those who subscribe to his Patreon account thing. Uh... Is that what he needs?